Hey everybody, this is a this is a Psycho Soldier. I'm going to show you all a video of me playing uh, Kino Deer on Toten. Just a little bit of strategy. I'll start it off with playing the hidden song so we can get this round started. So I can get show you how we can do going through round 50. Here's the first move here. Is the TV cut up? It's on the other side. can hear it. Is that good? Yeah. Alright. Here's the second meteor. Another rock. Maybe they store this for Japan. I don't want to open up that door because it'll ruin it won't ruin it but it'll make the train harder to run through there. See, I only got three perks there, but uh, here's the last. Here's the last meteor. So here's going to be the hidden song. One one five by Lena Sigma. I have discovered a grand. Let's see if it's going to play. Okay. All right. Secret. Can you hear it good? All right. Here we go. Let's start this out. Psycho Soldier A7X, 3,343 kills, 483 headshots. Oh, it's the Hellhounds, that's even better. It's a glitch right here, I can have more claymores. And I'll even show you the glitch we can get in to get to the Hellhounds, where they can't get you. Right here. Yeah, they don't get to me. I don't really like using it, but that's a little helpful too. Alright, let's get this through quick. I thought it was going to be 50. The, the zombies would come, but I guess 51 would be alright. I'd have no more room for playing worse. But yeah, when you run out of ammo and stuff, you can always use these, so it's a helpful tip. Don't do it when you're playing with multiple people because it'll lag you out of the game. I'm not for sure if you play offline to do that, but I'm pretty sure it'll do it when you're uh, playing on Xbox Live. So when you want to do that, just, you know, play it on solo. This gun right here is a lifesaver. Protect it with you every single time you start to run the train. When you have it like this, it'll always be there ready for you. If you ever get caught, like trapped like this, you just shoot it. That's all you have to do. It also takes out hordes of zombies really quick, too. So I only need these since I've got enough of them on the wall. But by this round, it really is not effective. Since you know it is running 50 run. It, I haven't played this continuously to get to round 51. It's just, you know, I've, I've paused it. I went to school. Well, actually, it was the day before I went to school. I got to like 25 or something like that. I paused it, went to bed, came home from school the next day, unpaused it. I just left it off like how it is. My, so my, my Xbox has been on for like three days straight. I don't even see how it's even doing it now. But, yeah, I got the old original first arcade Xbox, so, yeah. I ain't as good as it used to be. That's why I feel this like this. But yeah, just watch what I do, watch where I'm at. It'll help you. This is the best place to circle on the map, especially if you're just playing with yourself, the solo. And uh, yeah. 
playing with multiple people. There's another place you can circle. And there's another place after that, too. talking about the extra perks here how I just got three perks because I ran out of quicker bombs and it wasn't my fault the game lagged you can believe it or not but it lagged me like the whole game just paused for like two seconds and like next thing I knew I was in the horde of the zombies and I couldn't do anything about it and automatically went down that's what happened last time I tried to do this attempt the Xbox totally froze up sent me the main menu on zombies and it just said like an error uh, status no spawn, something like that. You guys probably had that ever happen to you, but I don't know. Just very weird stuff that happened. But yeah, when you're on this high route, I mean, you, you can be in the 30s and 40s and stuff, and like, still use these two guns. Always keep this with you, unless you want to end the round and keep the last zombie with you. And like trade it in for something if you know you're gonna run out or something you won't have enough. So yeah, always keep the thunder gun with you. You can trade this anytime. You want. It just it takes forever, forever to kill zombies with another gun when you're on this high run. You might be just talking about the same things over and over again. But yeah, it takes forever. Just do what you do. I just have to keep on shooting with my thunder gun. But yeah, these little crawler things, watch out for them because they will get in your way. They'll put you down. Happened many times before. I meant to get a video like this going a long time ago, but I just never got a chance to get around to it. So I finally just, you know, it's like, well, you know, we might as well just do it. So yeah. I'll be making more videos of this. I'm going to try to get on every single map out, out of every single zombie map that's ever been made. Play solo and uh, get to round, start off on round 50, 49, whatever, 51, and just show you how my strategy is, I, how you can survive solo on this hot round. But yeah, this is how you do it. Once see how you, I'm about to run out of the thunder gun ammo, once you do that, you just pack a punch, and just, you know, do it all over again. See how it just lagged right then? Hope it doesn't cut off in the middle of this. I'm not even getting hit by these zombies, it just shows I am where it's lagging so much, it's pretty crazy. No biggie though. I try to get through these rounds as quick as I can. It's probably took me, when I first got the round 1, one through 30, it didn't take me probably about 20 minutes it took me at the most to get to that round. But from there on... God, it's took me forever. I've been probably playing this for six hours straight, around 30 through 50. Because it just, I mean, it's just, it just takes forever to kill them. I'm already out of ray gun ammo. Thermal gun's about out. They're still responding because well, I'm on a high round right now. I've got a lot of higher rounds. I could get to higher rounds too, also, but I just I don't have time for it. I don't have the right Xbox for it. Just you know stuff like that. Just ain't gonna work. But yeah. Um, if you haven't, just check out some more of my videos on YouTube. Subscribe, like, comment, whatever. Just please tell your friends and stuff like that, so they'll know that they can subscribe to me or whatever. I mean, you can even send me, like, friend requests, game invites, stuff like that. If you want to play a game of zombies sometimes later, because I don't... It's just, sometimes I have bad connections and stuff like that. It flags me out, but I know when I will or not, so... 
Most of the time, it's, I have pretty good connection. I can show you over here what these uh, claymores are. All these claymores on the wall, you can just get them up. You can only get two at a time, though, but you can after you do that two at a time, you can just get them up any time you want and just kill the zombies. I can keep on doing this, but it'll get pretty boring, so I'm going to just do this. Show, show you as a little example right here. After I do this... I mean, it's still, it, just, it doesn't even affect them. It just gives me a little bit of points. I have a lot more points, but I'm spinning on the box and such. I got one more left, so... I hope this thing can slow me. Heck yeah. Oh, God. Good Lord, that was close. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that got me nervous. I've had closer calls, but yeah, that would, that would have been pretty bad if I went down right there. Might as well pack a punch both of them. Since I'm oh, yeah, these little tapes you can get in different rooms. Just put them in there, get to line them up through here. We get to get this. Uh, yeah. Just throw grenades out here. I mean, while you're up here, it doesn't really matter. Buy them off there. Keep on doing that if you want to, but I didn't have no time. Spawn you in these random rooms if you can. You'll find a little tape. They're usually like you'll be able to see them. You don't know what they look like. But yeah, that's what I mainly do. I just need to get back to head back to the theater. It was a mule kick. I would get mule kick, but it's just it's not. I I don't like it. I'll be honest with the perk. It's a good perk and all, but. I mean, with ammo consuming, but it's just, it ain't worth getting. If you got a thunder gun like this, and you want to save your life in time, to switch guns, like, twice, it's just, it'd be impossible to do. I mean, it's almost impossible as it is just to switch your guns twice when you're like, oh, heck yeah, next ammo. I just pack a punch both my guns. But yeah, I usually get max ammo when I pack a punch or trade my gun, so, you know. If that ever happens to you guys, yeah, it happens to me most of the time. Bunched up and went. Over here. And I circled up in one big bunch again. I come through here and just. Last one. I mean, this is about all you can do because if you use a regular gun. Not counting the thunder gun or ray gun, you would be just you'd be playing forever. I mean who wants to do that? Who wants to take hours and hours of their time just trying to shoot them with the regular just pea shooter that won't do any much of any good. Not much damage at all. Um let's see what else I can talk about. Uh more I don't really, I mean, it's good. You really need to get monkeys out of the box for special occasions because, like, you know, some people, like, if you want to go down, I usually, myself, not to brag or anything, but I usually don't go down. So, I really don't need monkeys. What the heck? That didn't work. Well, I usually don't use monkeys. I just, uh, when a max ammo happens, I go and, uh, throw all my monkeys that's what you need to do, throw all your monkeys, and then if you can, get run to the max ammo. If it's already blank and about to go get it, just forget about it, just go and get the max ammo. But if you know you can't get it in time, you know, just don't get it. Old Butters, one of my good friends, says he wants to grow up to be a zombie expert like I am. But yeah, it's like, okay, yeah, it's uh, he's, he's pretty good. Is this it? Is this seriously it? Well, I guess that shows it up for this. I mean, because I, mean, I can kill these zombies and just keep on going, but yeah. I don't want to bore you guys to death or anything, so. I guess I'll catch you all later, because I just keep on going, so.
Well, you just hit that like button, subscribe, do whatever. Thanks. Bye.